Ladies, can you teach me that wave? How does it work? You guys aren't getting trained me? Am I doing it right? Yeah? All right. <laughs> Favorite Thanksgiving dish? Um, my mom makes an incredible stuffing. And while the turkey is is always amazing, I feel like like that shit, you know, you just expect the turkey to be amazing. But my mom makes awesome in turkey. The turkey ain't nothing without the stuffing. Exa exactly. You got to stuff it with something. Kare kare. Uh, you got uh, sinigang, everything. <laughs> Probably my mom's cranberry apple blueberry cobbler. It's so good, and I love her peach cobbler. She always makes good desserts. Ooh, pasta. I love pasta. Yeah, I love pasta. <laughs> Favorite sauce on the pasta? It, it's my spaghetti sauce. Really? Oh, I make a very good sauce. Yeah. Candied yams. Candy yams. Yeah. More of the sweet tooth kind of guy. More of a sweet guy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's the deal. It is traditional turkey with our juicy red sauce, and I have an aunt who makes great apple pie too. Mashed potatoes and gravy. Like, is there a certain recipe that you're getting, or is it just some generic out of the can? Who's right? The, 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 the mashed potatoes definitely come from my grandma and my mother, and they have to be homemade. No instant mashed potatoes. And I do like a hint of garlic, maybe, chives, sour cream, sometimes maybe. But uh, the turkey gravy's got to be straight, real turkey gravy. Right, right. And then I'm happy. Mashed potatoes and gravy. Yes, yes. Is there a special way it's made that you get it, or just any? Mashed potatoes and gravy, as long as it's real. It's out of the, oh, it has to be real. It can't be out of the box, add water. Yeah, exactly. So I add water, like real mashed potatoes. Uh, I like the apple pie. I mean, you know, the stuffing and all that stuff is good, too, so. I'm so excited. I'm going home to Arizona. I'm uh, going to be hanging out with my cousins like crazy, Christopher, Dylan, Michael, Alex. Um, and uh, I'm going to be making awesome cranberry sauce with my Uncle Robert. Really? I do every year. Already in the kitchen, yeah. they got your grass. I always make cranberry sauce every year. It's like a tradition, so. Does that mean you just empty out the can? And uh, no, no, we actually, we buy, you know, we freeze them. Okay, real cranberry. Yes, we do, and like mash them up, you know, and oh, okay. so it's good, it's really good. All right, what's your favorite dish in Thanksgiving? Uh, probably the cranberries, I love cranberries, they're so good to eat. just saying that because you're the one making No, no, no. Probably the cranberry, like, the cranberry sauce, it's so good. Even from the can? Yes, from the can is the best. It looks like you still eat kind of healthy, but do you do you let yourself go for Thanksgiving? Yeah, a little bit because I can't help eating the stuffing and then the good good food, good wine, and everything. What's your favorite dish? I would say turkey with the uh, sweet potato. I, I just did a movie in New Orleans and I was like, oh man, this food is so good. Really? And like, so I'm going back to eat Thanksgiving with a whole bunch of friends that I met. Have the Cajun, like the it's, gators. This place called Giacomo's, right? And and I know it sounds really gross, but I had an alligator and shrimp cheesecake. What? But it's really all in one. Yeah, all in one. Definitely would have to be the stuffing. Stuffing. Yeah. Is this homemade stove top? But stove top for sure. That's the best kind, right? Uh, yes. Yeah. Do you make it yourself? No, I let the family make it. I just eat it. That's what I do. Lots stuffing. and lots of turkey. Yes. My mom makes stuffing. the best stuffing in the stuffing. world. Really? So that yeah. it's not stove top. No, it's not. It's actually yeah. it is. <laughs> but she puts stove top's good. She puts like her own little stuff in there, so it's cool. Um, mashed potatoes, big piece of turkey, and um, I just love the turkey. The big piece of turkey. Big piece. Yeah. Oh no, you can handle huge pieces of turkey. Wow, I can't even stomach that. A mashed potatoes. The stuffing, I love stuffing. Oh, that is good. Yeah, I'm good. Do you guys uh, cook at all for things? Um, you sit back and eat. <laughs> <laughs> I sit back and eat. Uh, I like making apple pie with my mom, and she makes like the best apple pie. It's really good. Sometimes I help, but not all the time. I'm not that good at cooking. Oh, so it ends up ruining it if you help. Yes. Mashed um, potatoes. Mine is pumpkin pie. Ooh, my grandma's stuffing. She makes a mean stuffing. It's she all makes homemade. a mean stove top stuffing. <laughs> no, it's all homemade. All homemade. Yeah, I know there's people that have certain waving strategies and parades. What's your waving strategy? Oh my goodness, I just give I just wave. You just flail your arms around, right? <laughs> you know what? I do the peace sign, I wave, pageant, you know, whatever I feel like. <laughs> um, I think maybe we could head nod. Acknowledge. Oh, oh you could do the that thing. The pointing. Yeah. Or do the, the the pound to the heart, the LL Cool J thing? Perhaps. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not cool enough to do that. You got to be really cool to do that. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah.
I guess me and LL are like a, you guys, a rare breed. Oh, you are definitely a rare breed. I, I give you that. Yeah, in fact, I got to go practice right now and stretch out a little bit. But I think it's like an elbow, elbow, wrist, wrist, something like that. It's almost as complicated as the Macarena I hear. I'm, I'm going to be doing this. Really? No, I'm kidding. I'm just going to be waving. No special one you plan on? No, no nothing in particular that I plan. Just kind of wave to different people. Once again, GreatedCheddar.com, getting to know the fans out here. Is this your first time checking out this parade? Oh, heck no. Every year. So what are you guys' favorite part about this parade? Right. The hard guy. And just the hard guy. Personally, the yeah, hard guy. The hard guy. The hard guy. The hard guy. Well, I don't know if you understood that gibberish. They all spoke at the same time. <laughs> they pretty much said I was their favorite part of the parade, if you didn't understand that. <laughs> right, so who were you guys most excited to see, I guess, today? Really? I want to Oh, we'll go on. Tori Spelling. Tori Spelling. Barry Williams. I don't know their names, but the hot guys. <laughs> Again, one for me. Yeah. Did you guys get any autographs or anything? Oh, yeah. yeah. We got pictures. So you plan on putting it on the MySpace? Oh, wow. Uh, <laughs> I, could, I could forge checks with that. That's awesome. <laughs> Justin, what's up again? Star of a High School Musical 3. I did not know you were into the whole freestyling thing, yeah, but I witnessed awesome it last night. Nice. Yeah. Well, last night we had a little competition because there was a Nickelodeon, uh, the girl yeah, from my rival Jeanette. So I was, you know, bagging on her a little bit, but it was right. all in fun. So, um. So you're gonna bash her again right now? No, 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 no. I thought that's what you were into. Behind her back. That would be unfair. Yo. Uh. Yeah. 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 Chilling in San Diego at the Mother Goose. We have wildin', we are loose, we are crazy, look at me and all the babies got up at the limo, they went crazy, oh my gosh, it's Justin, baby, if you see me in the streets, just say what's up and I'm not to beat, this is my man, the interviewer, and we're just making beats, going crazy, yeah. What's up? So, we gotta do the homie thing, you know. You know what? Justin just rocked a freestyle about you. Oh, Justin, come on. Did Justin do another freestyle? Okay. You got to retaliate. Oh, my gosh. Um, I'm Jeanette McCurdy here at the Mother Goose Parade, and you know that I'm not afraid because I'm pretty cool, and I got the rhymes, and I can even keep in with the time. I can beat Justin any day because he's easy. That's what I say. Oh. But last night, I witnessed you doing a little bit of freestyling. I wonder if we could uh, share that with the audience. Uh, Okay, yo, my name is Tony and I like to rap. I'll bust anybody that talks smack. So let me keep rapping until I die. West Coast, West Coast for life. What? We gotta add to that. Here we go. You gotta give me beats. Smash. Potatoes, potatoes, And gravy. Yeah. I heard you doing a little bit of sound check. It's sounding excellent. Could we get a little sample? Five, six, seven, the Grand Marshal Tori Spelling just walked by and looks like that about does it for the festivity for the uh, red carpet festivities here.